Now, I know many of us are eager for the snow to drop, but I think none more excited in the state than sled dogs. And if you were thinking about signing up for the Kuskokwim 300 this January, it's too late. Registration is capped out at 30 mushers after just 10 days, the most the race has seen in some years in the field. Features some heavy hitters. We got Jeff King, the king of the K300, the winningest musher in the race's history with nine victories. And right on his tail, P. Kaiser, the defending and seven-time K300 champ. He knows the area very well. We got Jessica Klecka, Katie Joe, and Jeff Dieter signed up. It'll be a very competitive field with the likes of Brent Sass, Jesse Holmes, Nick Petit, Eddie Burke Jr., Richie Deal, plus a number of other Iditarod veterans in the mix. We got the 2022 Rookie of the Year, Jason Pavilla, Raymond Alexis going for the long distance title. Aaron Burmeister coming out of quote unquote retirement. I know mushers never really truly retire. He did his first race back in 99. He's back behind the sled 25 years later. The 45th annual Cuscoquim 300, January 26th with a mass start of 30 mushers out of Bethel should be a good one. Just hopefully we have snow by then. <laughs> yes, let's hope so. What a great lineup. Well, yeah, Jackie, no what do you think? <laughs> well, the romance of that race is so wonderful. It's the reality that's, that's right. brutal. Yeah. Yeah. Especially no if kidding. they don't get the conditions they want. And I know. And the but the camaraderie with the dogs, that's it's cool. It's great. Let's